Why do we celebrate Christmas? It is Christmas tomorrow and I can't wait to see all the gifts that I will get. Yes, and also all the delicious food that we will get. Yum! We have also put up our Christmas tree and it's looking so beautiful. Hold on. You know that there is more to Christmas than just food and gifts, right? Christmas has a significant meaning for Christians around the world. Oh, I know. We celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ. But do you know the story behind the birth of Jesus Christ? No. Please tell us. A long time ago, there was a lady called Mary who was married to Joseph. They went to visit Bethlehem, but they could not find a place to stay and had to spend the night in a barn. And this is where baby Jesus was born. Oh, please do go on. A bright star came up in the sky just above the barn where Jesus was born. When shepherds in the fields saw the star, they believed that the King of Men was born and told everyone that the Son of God was born. Oh, so that's why they make a barn with a baby and all the sheep and everything. Yes. So you see, Christmas is not just about gifts and food. It is about the birth of Jesus Christ and most importantly it is time to spend time with your family and friends love and forgive everyone and thank God for all that he has given you Why do we put up Christmas trees during Christmas? I am so excited! My father has brought a Christmas tree. We are going to put up our tree today. That's so nice. We put up our trees two days back. I love decorating the Christmas tree every year. It is one of my favorite things about Christmas. Me too. But I have always wanted to know why we keep a Christmas tree at home during Christmas. I don't know. But let's go ask the professor. Hello children. Excited for Christmas? Yes, professor. But how did this practice of keeping Christmas trees at home start? People first started keeping Christmas trees over 500 years ago in Germany. When people from Germany moved to America, they continued to keep the Christmas tree at home. This practice caught on with other people in America and soon the idea of having a Christmas tree spread throughout the world. I am so happy that this practice started. After all, what is Christmas without a nice big Christmas tree? You're right. And Merry Christmas to you both. Merry Christmas to you too, Professor. Merry Christmas to you too, Professor. Santa's reindeer able to fly? Christmas is next week and I'm so excited! 
I can't wait to see what gifts Santa leaves for me this year. Yes, I know. Just imagine Santa carrying so many gifts and being led by his reindeer. Caterpillar, reindeer do not have wings. So how are they able to fly? Reindeer are able to fly because of magic. Magic? Really? Professor, what kind of magic? Christmas magic. It is said that Santa gives the reindeer magical carrots and grains to eat before they fly. This gives them the strength to fly. Some even say that Santa sprinkles magic aviation dust, which also helps them to fly. That's so cool. I love Christmas, not only because of the gifts and the wonderful food, but also because of these magical stories. That's what's called the Christmas spirit. Yes, Professor. Enjoy your Christmas and happy holes. give gifts to children who do not have a chimney at home and with the help of the reindeer Santa is able to go to every child's house he then goes down the chimney and leaves each child's gift at their home that is so nice I wonder what gift Santa will leave for me this year I have been good this year, so I hope Santa leaves me a bicycle. This year, I will leave milk and cookies by the fireplace. If Santa is hungry and tired, he will have something to eat and drink. Quiet everybody! Oyster, why are you looking so upset? What is wrong? Professor, you said that Santa comes down the chimney and leaves presents. We just moved home and we do not have a chimney at our new home. Does that mean that Santa will not come to my house this year? No, Oyster. Santa will definitely come to your house. But how, Professor? I don't have a chimney at home. Simple. By magic. Santa has his own way of making sure that he reaches all children. Some say that Santa has a magical key with which he quietly enters and leaves. It is also said that Santa can magically make a chimney appear and disappear. So, don't worry. Santa will find a way to give you your Christmas gifts. Thank you, Professor. I wish I could stay up the entire night to thank Santa for coming.